Welcome back to Specularia. It's Cindy and today I have an epic mail haul video. So this is mail that I've gotten over the last six months that gets sent to my U.S. post box that my family hangs on for me because I don't live in America and I try to take advantage of the um, cheaper shipping costs of getting things in America. So this is about a half a year of mail. So let's begin. So this is just a white envelope. We'll see what's inside. This is a Lady Lovely Locks Silky Puppy. So cute. My gosh, so cute. That's parcel number one. Sorry if there's a bit of noise outside. It is very warm today and um, the window must be open. Parcel number two. I see pink. We have the second of the two Lady Lovely Locks dogs that I have been waiting for. Yay! Sisters! And they're slightly different. So cute. I think we have a fairy tale bird. We do. Yay! So this is a fairy tale bird. I see a pony. Ah, what a beauty. So this is a G1 My Little Pony. Okay, newsprint. Under the newsprint we have a bag. Inside the bag I see some pony feet. Do you see pony feet? <laughs> oh my god, he's so beautiful. So these are more G1 ponies. And we have a Lady Lovely Locks dragon. And a baby pony. And another beautiful pony. This one feels soft. There he is. Oh my goodness, he's a little Sesame Street honker. He's a little honker. So cute. <laughs> Another package. Let's see, oh, I spot a popple. So this is a popple that I have been wanting that I didn't have before. Yay! Cutesy! <laughs> Let's pop them. Pop, pop, pop. There we go. Adorable. Next envelope. I see pony feet. Oh yay! A twice as fancy. 
Yay! So cute! More G1 ponies. <laughs> this one is a bait pony. It's missing its tail. Next package. I'm going to try to move through these as quickly as I can. I'm not going to give a whole lot of information. Oh yes, the third of the Lady Lovely Locks puppies. I'm doing, I have a little uh, little collection of these babies. I may resell uh, one or two of them, but um, yeah, I acquired a few of them. And this is a little hooks, a little hooks toy. And I absolutely love the colors. It's so fun and adorable. Oh, and some sweets and a pencil. <laughs> so cute. Okay, now a bigger bag. Oh, wow. These are, how exciting. These are Wonder Whims. Oh my goodness. Wonder Whims. <laughs> so this one is the owl. And they need a wash, definitely, these babies. That's not a problem, though. It's so cute. <laughs> Next package. Oh, we have a couple of popples. Popple number one. <laughs> so cute. And popple number two. These are the slightly newer popples. Okay, still a ways to go, guys. I know what this is. Any idea yet? Whoops. <laughs> Unruly bubble wrap. It is a turtle tot. Turtle tot. So cute. Little turtle tot. Oh, we have some more pony Ishmael. We have a fairy tale bird. <laughs> and this little friend, my little pony. So cute. Indeed it is. It's the rocker popple that I do not have. Hold on, let's pop them. There we go. What a cutie pie. <laughs> Just repop you back into your little pouch. Okay. And a box. Oh, I think I see a popple, a corn chip. Oh my god, so cute. Look at that face. This is my favorite popple of all time. Little corn chip. He's so cute. <laughs> Here's the pile, guys. So far. <laughs> OK. 
Okay. Oh my goodness. These are my little brush -a loves This is a little collection of little brush -a loves that I got ages ago. Look at that little sweet part. Oh my gosh. Little brush of love. <laughs> I may do another video to give you a little more information on all these things. If uh, you would like that, just leave me a comment. This is another little brush of love. Oh my goodness. So cute. Look at those faces. I was originally kind of concerned about how much stuff I was going to have to bring back in the car, but most of these plushies are like considerably smaller than I realized because a lot of them I've actually never even seen before. So there's that. That's good news. I know what this is. Any hints yet? Who knows what this is? It is a magic nursery pet. My very first. My very first magic nursery bunny. Oh my goodness. How beautiful. Look at that little face. And the little, the belly button. I love the belly button so much. Oh my gosh. What a cutie pie. These boxes, all of this looks much like bulkier and bigger than it really is, thankfully. I'm pretty sure everyone thinks I'm crazy because of all of these boxes that I've been storing at my family's house. Um, so they're probably like, how are you going to get this all back? But it's not actually going to be too bad. Uh-oh, we see popcorns. I really hate popcorns. <laughs> they're too unruly. Oh, this is like a little bow. Maybe it goes to whatever this vintage toy in here is. We have a series of things. Oh, I think I know what these are. So I only discovered these toys recently and they cracked me up so much. I'm so happy to see them. Anybody have any idea yet what this could be? Here we go. It's just uh... <laughs> These are gorgeous creatures. So, I mean, imagine a Barbie doll. But it's like a pig or um, a cow. <laughs> oh my god, they're so glamorous. I love this so much. Let's find a bag. There we go. We'll just keep these little beauties inside a bag. I think there's three of them in here. If I recall. <laughs> oh my god, look at her face. These are amazing. Oh, there might be four of them actually. This looks like there's something else in there. <laughs> They're amazing, right? in here. Oh yeah, there is a fourth one. I couldn't remember. This one's more like a hippo. I love these. <laughs> okay. So let's contain these packing peanuts. Keep it all contained. Oh, I know what this is. Oh my goodness, look at this beauty. Who knows what this is? This is a PJ Sparkles pet. And I had been haunting her and haunting her on eBay. And she was so expensive. But then eventually, because I guess she didn't sell and a charity shop was selling her, they actually took my offer and I was able to get her for a very reasonable price. 
and I'm really excited. She's so cute. And I have a PJ Sparkles at home who will be very happy to hang out with her. Okay. I think it's just my little zigzag zebra. Yeah, so this is a little zigzag zebra, my little pony friend. Super cute, great condition. I recently found one of these at um, a value village in a bag. Not as good condition, so... Oh, I know what this is. This is another Wonder Whim. This one is that sweet, adorable, like, pink calf. How cute. <laughs> okay. So this is like a worm. And he actually kind of articulates like a worm. And he is for strawberry shortcake. You can put little strawberry shortcake dolls in these two baskets and they can go for a ride. <laughs> oh, I see ponies. Yay, look at this beautiful carousel pony. She's got some marker. We're going to have to clean her up. But she's really cute. And pony number two. This package. We have this little bitty thing. What could it be? Oh, it's a little pretty kitty. What a doll. That is so cute. <laughs> little kitty. I also have a birthday present in here. One of these packages. I see some blue fur. Blue fur. What could it be? Sorry if I'm a little out of pan. I'm just gonna get the tape off of this box. There we go. Okay. I know what this is. <laughs> we have a little theme with these packages. Um, these are Wonder Whims. So I became a little bit obsessed with Wonder Whims recently because I never heard of them before. And they are by far the coolest looking plush toys that I have ever seen. Like the design is amazing. And they come in these sets. They come with a book and like a wand. Um, they are so cute and I think I have all of the ones that I wanted except for maybe one but I'm not feeling too like obsessed with getting it like I were these ones happy 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 next big box I see a leaf printed envelope I think that's everything I may have to split this video in two just to clear out. This feels squishy. Squishy. Oh, I know what this is. Okay, this is like exciting for a few reasons. So, see this poor, sad, broken hearted brush of love, okay? You see this poor thing? His nose is ripped open. His fur is in pretty decent but not too decent condition um he's actually don't be traumatized he's missing his tail it's been cut off the brush is gone i got this poor little thing for so in like immensely cheap that it just gave me an idea that i'm going to customize this little brush of love i'm going to fix him up i'm going to re like i'm going to slicker brush his fur i'm going to clean him and I'm going to totally revamp this baby, give him a brand new brush and a brand new tail. And he's going to be so beautiful. So his life is not over. I will save him. But we're going to plunk him back in his bag. Maybe, maybe not, maybe a different bag. Um, to just kind of keep him separate from all the other buddies that I have. There we go. I think this is my other coin chip. 
So sometimes you have a favorite popple and you need two of them because they're your favorite. Because they actually all really like look very different. Specifically corn chip. Like this little baby is so cute. She needs a good brush and like we'll fluff her all up nice. She'll look amazing. So cute. <laughs> Next large box. Oh, I know what this is. Any hints? What could it be? Secret Keepin's Pop. What a cutie pie. This little baby I actually found on eBay. Nobody had been bidding on him. I don't know if the, um, the listing was just like not in the algorithms that um, eBay require to um, make it show up. I'm not sure. He doesn't have the key. I have an extra key for secret and keepings pups though, so I'm not too concerned. Um, he's the purple one and he's very cute. Let's take a look at the pile. Not looking too bad, right? Okay. Okay. Inside here. <gasps> What do we have? We have Wonder Whims. The rest of my Wonder Whims. Okay, so you may have already seen that I have these Wonder Whims. So this is the second set of the purple Wonder Whims, the owl, and this girl. And these ones are actually in better condition. So the other ones I'm actually going to really be, I'm going to be cleaning all of these toys, but I'll be cleaning up one set of these Wonder Whims and passing them along, probably for sale in the shop eventually once I get it set up. She is so perfect. She is so amazingly perfect. Look at her little tongue. Oh my gosh, she's so beautiful. <laughs> and there's her tail and her brush. She is so precious. The box mountain is becoming a mountain. All right, can I do this all in one video? Let's see. Okay, these two things are actually not mine. Oi, this is mine. Oh my gosh, this is extremely exciting. <laughs> oh my god, it's a cuddle bright. Can you believe it? It's a Cuddle Bright. <laughs> and this Cuddle Bright is fully functioning, works wonderfully. I saw a video of it um, before I got it. <laughs> it's so cute. The only thing it's missing is it's little Cuddle Bright's tag. Um, but those are actually not too difficult to find. It needs a good clean. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Paper. Lots and lots of paper. Feels squishy. Oh yay. This is the third of the brush loves that I've been waiting for. So he's got a little bit of dirt on his nose, but I'll be able to clean that up no problem. And he is so cute. Look at that little tongue. Oh my gosh. Brush. Mirrors in great shape. He is just beautiful. This is a smaller box. I know what this is. <laughs> this is my other Sesame Street honker. <laughs> I love these guys so much. They're so cute. Now we're getting down to the three big boxes. Oh yeah. 
cut of some very strong tape. It is tougher than me. There we go. I see some orange. I see some pink. Any ideas? It's a bit of a theme to some of these packages, right? These look like popple bums. Little pocket popple. They're so cute. Little pocket popples are so beautiful. <laughs> and another popple. <laughs> and another popple. Another popple. These all came together in one big lot. And I'm so stoked about this. It is the Popples Backpack. Amazing. It's amazing. Okay. So this box, I'll probably keep some of this stuff in. Let's take a look at the pile. You can probably hear my daughter in the background. Okay. Okay. We're getting there. Some people love tape too much. I'm actually one of those people, that, so I can't really complain. <laughs> Oy, almost. The world's tape supply. Okay. Let's see what we have. Oh, okay, I know what this is. This is a big lot of toys that I got. It's the craziest thing. Um, there's a whole bunch of really weird random stuff in here, but I'll just go through it. So, inside this blue bag, we have this Poochie for Girls. It's like, um, keys and cash, pretty coin purse with its own coin holder. It's still in box. Um... I don't know that I'm really going to keep it in the box, though. Sorry for those of you who are going to cry about me opening it. It's just not that um, important to me to be in box. And I'm not even like, this was not the reason that I picked this up. This is just a cute little thing. Um, poochie coin purse. But I won't be keeping the box. I know it's like a thing for some people, but not for me. And then in here we have this purple silky puppy. Very cute. A little bit of scraping on the flocking. I can figure that out though. I have so much hair to fix, old toy hair to uh, fix. And we have a moon dreamers, panda, or panda polar bear. And a Cabbage Patch Pony. And another white Silky Puppy. A Glow Worm. A Strawberry Shortcake with no shirt. Another glow worm. Okay, and then these are very, very much in need of some TLC. So we have the hair separated from these beautiful glow bugs, and we're gonna fix them. These are from 1984, and they're extremely difficult to find, relatively expensive. Um, and so this is like a project for me, just like the brush of love that's all destroyed. It's a project. So we're going to wrap that back up. And I think we'll keep these toys in a separate bag because they're a little dirty. And I like to keep any dirtier toys on their own because they all need a bath. Okay. That's all those guys. We can all live together. Now we have another silky puppy. This one is gray. And it's like really cute. 
So much hair to deal with. Okay. And then a yellow one. Perfect flocking. Really soft, beautiful. And then two more. Here. So two more of these babies. Once again, I need to reattach the hair, but I'm totally cool with that. I think this one's hair is in here somewhere, and if not, I have the perfect fur hair to put on this guy, but I think it is. Um, okay, another of these, but this one is a kitty, kitty cat. So the flocking is perfect. It needs a really good clean. So... The last six months were spent shopping. The next six months are going to be spent cleaning. <laughs> we have another glow worm. And another one of these little sweeties. We've got to clean this one up. Another sweetie pup, yellow, perfect flocking, soft. And another one, purple, perfect flocking, a bit of dirt around the mouth. This was just a crazy big toy lot. Another um, silky pup. Okay, and then two of these, these are also moon dreamers. I think this is Ursa, no, it's not Ursa Minor. I can't remember the name of this one. And then we have the Moon Dreamers Lion. Another Cabbage Patch Pony. And this little sweet pea. Is that a Blinkins, I believe? I can't remember exactly the name so of all these toys. This was one big estate lot, so I don't recall everything. And we have a little strawberry shortcake. And this is the hair from the blue guy that we saw earlier. Um, this is a Moon Dreamers uh, villain. And this is just a little, little doll. And a little this pet shop tag. And a small little comb that says Rainbow Dash. And a little dress. I'm not sure who that goes to. And this weird little dog that I'm not really keeping. Yeah. <clears throat> and then the piece de resistance of this whole thing is this. This is the Moon Dreamers incredible dragon vehicle with the ball i mean this is incredible i'm so happy with this um weird toy collection okay so I'll just put all these guys back in here like that and i only have i believe one more box this might just be bubble wrap it is I think these look like my keepers. Yeah, so I got an entire lot of keepers. Some of these I will be selling. They're in beautiful condition. So this is the keeper's horse. I mean, amazing, clean, beautiful keepers. And a second one, same deal, extremely clean gorgeous these are in incredible condition so far oh my goodness she is beautiful and I have a second one of her yeah I do 
another beautiful snail. And I'm so excited I don't have this swan. I'm very happy to have found her. So beautiful and clean, well taken care of. Perfect hair, just utterly perfect. And most happiest is this bunny. I'm so happy to have this bunny. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful and it's in perfect condition. Look at the hair, it's just so perfect. And here are all the keys and the finder toys that come with them in the brush. Um, and a few more little keepers are in here. Just get these open real quick. Let's see what we have. Look at that little sweetie pie. Oh my goodness. I really love these. These are so cute. And the little baby swan. And the little pony. Perfect curled hair. Beautiful. And baby snail. So, so cute. That's where you put things inside this little pouch. And I think that that is everything. So, thank you guys for hanging out with me while I did this epic mail haul. This is not at all the kind of thing you will commonly see on this channel, as I don't normally have this many toys to open. Um, I had a little bit of a... Um, a reason for acquiring a lot of these toys so yeah there's the pile it's pretty cool right some of these are going to get resold um, because I do have a few doubles of certain things and um, anyways thank you for hanging out and I hope you enjoyed this epic mail time video and um, if you'd like to follow along with me on some other uh, toy videos and adventures subscribe to the specularia uh, I'm sorry specularia on YouTube click the notification bell to see when we make new videos um, and follow us on Instagram as the specularia have a great day Thank you.